Welcome back to Floaters Academy. Today we will discuss task two in the writing. The task given is: Some people believe that allowing children to make their own choices on everyday matters such as food, clothes, and entertainment is likely to result in a society of individuals who only think about their own wishes. Other people believe that it is important for children to make decisions about matters that affect them. Discuss both these views and give your own opinion. In this type of questions, you have to give explanations of two views given. You have to discuss the two views given. And uh, in the body one, you have uh, body one, the one point, and I mean one point means one para, and in body two, another view. So both of these views should be discussed in body one and two, and in body three, your own opinion. This is how this type of uh, task goes. So, let's ex explain. A few persons opinion that permitting children to make their own choices, such as food, clothes, and entertainment, would make a selfish society. Whereas other people have the opinion that the children must be allowed to make choices that affect them. Though the children can make decisions, it will not act one so that they have to be monitored. The introduction part, we discuss about uh, both the views and uh, put forward our own view in the thesis statement. The introduction should be a paraphrasing for the sake of the students, those who do, do not know how to begin the essay, just paraphrase the task given and, and uh, in the second sentence you put forward your own opinion and the body one in the body one we discuss one pattern of uh, view here the, go the discussion goes like this the children in some countries are made to make choices but which is not the right way to achieve good individuality. They should be screened by the elders in what to say and what to do. Usually, the choice that they make is based on the immediate desire, not on a well-trimmed evaluation. The elders with the with their life experience is able to lead the children. The process of decision making is not a simple thing. It has to be screened before done. The early choice of the children leads to the disorientation of the personality. The traits of selfishness is another problem that we find in the children. The excessive freedom ends in extreme form of selfishness. And body two, we discuss other view. A few others favor freedom take freedom to take decisions in the matters that affect them. The children who make their own choices at an early stage 
as a plus point of being bald. The children tend to make choice, wrong choices. It is the law of the nature. The person who stands for child freedom addresses the issue of it in terms of individual freedom. They ask the rest of the people to come into terms with their point of view. Besides, they stand for the philosophy of self-freedom to all. They never agree with the point of being controlled. This philosophy has to be screened with the life of children who has been allowed immense freedom in their childhood days. In my opinion, body 2 is over and body 3 is our opinion. In my opinion, the children should have a limited freedom and this freedom must be screened by the elders. They should be able to have choices with the help of elders only. More than anything, the freedom is not a license to do anything, rather it is a freedom of rationality. The life of a child is the expectation of the parents and hope of the society. If the society needs a gentleman in future, they should train those children good manners and cultures. They must also be trained to make good decisions in life. In addition, they must know about the financial capability of their parents before making any choice on food, clothes and other entertainment factors. Moreover, the child must also learn lessons of being thrift and accurate in their daily life. Then only they will be able to save money for, for a better future. So the third body is over. In the first body we discussed uh, one point of view and uh, in the second body we dis discussed about other point of view that's given in the task. Two, two views are given in the task. Two views have been covered in the first and second and in the third we discuss our own opinion and the conclusion we conclude it. In conclusion it is inevitable to have a controlled childhood for the future of a child. They must have a freedom of cho choice under the screening of elders. So, in the, in, the, in the conclusion, we concluded the major points and uh, made our stand clear. This is how this type of questions and task given have to be dealt. Thank you.